Hi, my name is Arvind Jain. I'm on the products team here at Apigee. And today I'm going to show you how to create a new custom report in Edge Analytics. So here we are at the main dashboard of the management console for Apigee Edge. To create a custom report, you go under the analytics section and go under reports. So the report that we're going to create is going to show you how to measure and look at the traffic for all your proxies broken down by individual proxies. And then we're going to also add another level of um, drill down that allows you to see the breakdown of the traffic for that particular proxy across all the different apps that are calling into that API. So let's name the report. So we're going to call it traffic for proxies and apps. So we're going to select the line view format so they can see the traffic over time. And the first thing we're going to do is select the metric that we want to view. So that's the traffic metric. And we're going to look at the sum of the traffic um, for each sample of time. And we're going to add two dimensions. The first dimension is going to be looking at the particular proxy. And so this will show you a breakdown of the traffic across each of the different API proxies. And the second dimension we're going to add is developer app. And that's all there is to it. Once you save it, you're taken to the view of that custom report that shows you the total traffic today. Right now, we're looking at the traffic over the past hour. So here, we're seeing a breakdown of the traffic across each of the different proxies that are configured for this particular organization. So we have catalogs, offers, products, stores, OAuth, and users. So these six APIs. For us to now look at how the traffic that are hitting the catalogs API are being called, we select that and we can see that there are actually six different apps that are calling into the catalogs API and you can see a breakdown of those calls that are coming from those different apps. So we can either select it down here or pull down the drop down menu and select a different proxy to see the breakdown of the traffic for that particular proxy as well. That's it for today.